countries with the highest default risk in 2022. In May 2022, the South Asian nation of Sri Lanka defaulted on its debt for the first time. Not only does this impact Sri Lanka's economic future, but it also raises an important question, which other countries are at risk of default. Bloomberg's Sovereign Debt Vulnerability Ranking is a composite measure of a country's default risk. To better understand this ranking, let's focus on Ukraine and El Salvador as examples. Why are Ukraine's bond yield so high? Ukraine has high default risk due to its ongoing conflict with Russia. To understand why, consider a scenario where Russia was to assume control of the country. If this happened, it's possible that Ukraine's existing debt obligations will never be repaid. That scenario has prompted a sell-off of Ukrainian government bonds, pushing their value down to nearly 30 cents on the dollar. Because yields move in the opposite direction of price, the average yield on these bonds has climbed to a very high 60.4% as a point of comparison. The yield on a U.S. 10-year government bond is currently 2.9%. Credit default swaps, CDS, are a type of derivative, financial contract, that provides a lender with insurance in the event of a default. If a CDS has a spread of 300 bits per second, 3%, this means that to insure $100 in debt, the investor must pay $3 per year. Applying this to Ukraine's 5-year CDS spread of 10,856 bits per second, 108.56%, an investor would need to pay $108.56 each year to insure $100 in debt. This suggests that the market has very little faith in Ukraine's ability to avoid default. Why is El Salvador ranked higher? Despite having lower values in the two metrics discussed above, El Salvador ranks higher than Ukraine because of its larger interest expense and total government debt. According to the data above, El Salvador has annual interest payments equal to 4.9% of its GDP, which is relatively high. In September 2021, El Salvador became the first country in the world to adopt Bitcoin as legal tender.